going to be a lot of background noise, but this is how we keep them cold until we get them all laid out. Get this big old big one up here. Gonna get the cheats. You get a pop? I got one over there on the ground. Hello. Wow. <laughs> what is this fish? Grouper. That is a grouper. That is a grouper. It's a big grouper. Yeah, it says a grouper. Wow. Is this a good season? Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. You gotta go offshore though. We are like 40 miles offshore. I did get a few bones out of that last cut. What last cut? Last time we went out? Oh, really? That's surprising. No! It's probably the... It was the fish dip. Because there's throats in that fish dip. Yeah, make sure you chew it all. Don't until you're done chewing. <laughs> That's the rule. All right. Yeah, I like better getting the rib off the first. Like you would a snapper. Bubble flies pretty sharp. I'll give you that. Yeah, I haven't used that one in a while. Holy but... shit. Gags. These are pretty good too, though. 
little button right here. Get underneath this. Yeah. The glory, but. Gonads or are those eggs? Uh, I think they call both female and male reproductive satchels gonads. Should we save this for Alex since it was his fish? There you go, buddy. So your fish is a giant gonad. <laughs> Smoker. guys caught over there? I didn't talk to nobody and I don't give up. <laughs> <laughs> used to be uh, conversational. <laughs> Not so much. So I realized that people just. Oh. 
<laughs> you can't even get a break. You can't even be a nice guy anymore. Bit one squash, uh, I guess. Yeah. Some of these guys, it's nice to outline them and then outline the other side while it's still. Yeah. Full. I did try that sometimes. It's like leave one on and start working on the other. Yeah, because it makes it where it's but, not concave. Yeah. But with these guys, No, those don't matter. This guy, though, I think it helps. I used to just whack off the fillets and then work the bones later, but. Get first. Get oh, going up and over the rib cage? Yeah. yeah. Just gotta find that one little line right there. That line, you can just take yeah, yeah, you get a little bit more meat if you can off. find it. The smaller ones, I just cut the whole side off on those snapper. Well, I do it more like this on the small ones because more. Yeah, look at it that way. Get them the translucent. Yeah, usually we're here in the freaking dark, so. Right. Why don't we have like a freaking sticky uh, umbrella over here? <laughs> Come on. Oh, so. Hell, I had to build this table to get another cutting station. <laughs> A wormy worm. Ain't gonna hurt you. Yeah, some people do, but that but that one's in the shade right now, the other one. This one's not. Stamus, but it's a big old honk. What's that? It's, it's a stamus, stamus, whatever, uh, center time. Oh, the I'd boat. I thought you said um, that. Did you already do the fuel? Check the fuel? Uh, what did you say? It was like 70 something or 80? How do you do it again? You hit set, set, set. On the little box, right? It's optimus. Or you hit menu and then set. Menu. Wow. As long as your key on. You don't have to do oh, the key is not on. Yeah, It'll key on. You got to put the key on. Key, key on. on. Oh, that's why I wasn't good. Yeah. Okay. Hit menu and then Those set, set. What are them? Grouper. Right, grouper. Grouper. <laughs> That one, I think we already cut the big one. Yeah, that guy is big. We had another one that was bigger. Really? This one's big. Yeah. 
These are the smaller ones. Yeah, we had a, a bigger one. This, was, big, this was the big one. This is the biggest one. He looks a little skinny now. <laughs> <laughs> He's on a diet. Yeah. They get a little rinse here. That's what I was doing. I was That's what was in that other one. Oh, no kidding. That's definitely rough. Um, I was going to turn the key on. Yeah, turn the key on, wait for it to come up, and then hit yeah, menu, and then know, set. Uh, you came over here. But you already got, you know how much we used, like, eight? I don't, I'll he check checked it. it on the way in. Get you a bill, don't worry. You came over for the cleaner, you did. <laughs> Maybe. Everybody knows why you're over here. There we go. Yeah, You know, you're not supposed to rinse these with fresh water, but this is a different kind of meat than regular fillets. Yeah, I don't think they're... This is more like chicken than it is fish. Why don't you throw those in the bucket? There's trash in there. Yeah. We're gonna overflow that bucket. That's what that's for. I was just trying to get to a fucking motion. Mightily thirsty. Oh. I can't do this without a cutting glove anymore. It freaks me out. Without what? Without a cutting glove. I cut myself real bad once right here. Uh, Plus you can grip the fish a little bit better. Oh, I'm getting married. Shouldn't you know better than doing that? Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> You well. That's on her. <laughs> you know how hard it is to find a girl that will fuck with me? <laughs> With all her teeth? <laughs> Come on now.
Yeah, this is what I wish you could get, but you can't. Good weapon. What's up? Oh yeah. Yeah, the only That's way you so get that is just cook them. You just cook them whole. Is the only way you can get those. Little bird friends not here today. Yeah, the nice thing about these ones out there, once you get past that depth, they tend to have less worms. This guy's got one big one in there, but that big one didn't have nothing. Huh? It doesn't hurt you if you eat it. No, but it's just not appetizing looking. I guess if I'm doing throats, I ought to do them all, huh? Don't break that green thing. It's like bile or something. Even this little guy's got eggs in it. Breeding season. Yeah. That shape kind of weird. Look for that. Uh, I'm good right now. Thanks. I'm good. An extra beer, I'll take one. I don't know if there's such thing as an extra beer, but find one. This guy's shaped really weird, dude. 
He must have got, he must have got, got injured at some point. Oh yeah, look at it. There's a scar there. He got, he got clipped. chomped on. Yep. A shark or something. Mm -hmm. Fishy fish world. Yep. That was one thing we didn't get today. That we know of. I thought I did, but it turns out we're good at retreating. <laughs> Lost tackle. Terminal <laughs> tackle. Yeah, that's crazy. We first fish of the day broke the <laughs> broke the brand new pole. Shout out Shimano. Don't buy anything off the clearance rack, guys. Hashtag, that's <laughs> Ten minutes later, we catch it with with his hook in the mouth, and it was like a twenty-six inch red grouper. <laughs> you can't build a rod that can't handle a twenty-six inch red grouper. What are y'all doing? I have mostly Shimano rods, and yeah, I know I love Shimano. Everything I have is Shimano. But that thing had to have a flaw in it to no, break with 100%. a couple of pounds of pressure on it. Wrong. No. First, and his drag was loose. He was trying to tighten the drag. Pow, pow. <laughs> I didn't even have to ask. I knew. <laughs> you didn't have to turn around and look. Uh, I just turned around to see what he was going to do about it. <laughs> you have to go show that to him. That was what was in that big red grouper. Was yeah, I was going to. I kept it out for you. Holy shit! That's everything that was in that Fucking big one. Row, man. Might be smoke that and eat it. Uh, <laughs> I'll let you do that. No, I mean, it's probably not bad, but we'll feed it. We'll feed it to the. Uh, I mean, I've had fish fish. before. It's not that big of a deal. I'll tell you what, caviar. man. Our our cats used to go crazy <laughs> over the row. You know, when we would come back in for fishing, the cats. Would you guys were cleaning at the house, right? What's that? You'd clean at the house back yeah, in the day. Yeah, because we were cleaning the fish at the house, so they would know when the boat came home that there was some fish coming. You know. And uh, they would come hang around, and then and if there was row in the fish, the fucking it. cats would go crazy. They were on it. Look at this guy got bit by something. Yeah, I think he did. <laughs> Big gonads. Yeah. They already put them to sleep. The boat? Yeah. Uh, no. did, we, did we kill the power on the trolling motor yet? I don't think that's what I was asking. You know where that is? There's a breaker in the front. You lift up the anchor blocker and then like to the, like a push button. Left, to the left there's a major battery switch in the anchor locker on the bow. That's kind of, there's something wrong. There's no way. It was, it worked fine this time. It did. I, I guarantee you it was because the house battery was low because we left it on before. That should have nothing to do with it. It shouldn't, but it was seeing a low voltage. I'm not sold on that kind of system if that's what's going to happen. Well. I mean, it's like heat's charging it every single time. You know, if it just charges when you're running off the off the cranking motor. And you have the ability to charge while you're running. Yeah, because it was 100% all day long. You give me a long cut. There's definitely something to be said about that. There's another big old biggin. This guy's all 29 inches too.
Yeah. See, I'll do all that just for that little chunk of meat like right there. Yeah. That all adds up. Like you were saying, the palatability. You turned I guarantee if you got a bone in that fish dip, it was from the cheek. Game over. Now, Leah swallowed one once. And it just scratched her throat. Yeah. It wasn't real big. It was one of them pin bones. She just felt it going in. Freaked out a little bit. That's what happens when you eat whole fish. How far do you have to go to get these? Um, we're about just shy of 120 feet. Okay. Nice. Yeah.
everything fine, so it hasn't died yet. I see a lot more, uh, see motors now. Yeah, they're, because they're a lot more reasonable. Come on, Mac, I did all those grouper and you ain't finished these uh, yet? So 30 snapper is not equal to 8 <laughs> Come on. Yamaha is already making a hydrogen motor. They designed the XTO to be able to do it. Right, you convert it. Like, they're looking... I don't think they're putting out any production base, though. Yeah, but they're just looking to... It's probably just to appease the government. Yeah. Uh, it's, 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 yeah. Uh, well, they've designed them... Like, intake plan them to do... Uh, What's the shit that they cut out of the car, old cars all the time? CO2. Converters. They're going to put those on outboards now. You believe that shit? Yep. They're going to put water. Oh, what kind of fish is that? Through a catalytic That's just a lane snapper. Those lane were big snapper. grouper. Oh, you got some big grouper? Yep. Cool. Their lane snapper's pretty. How many? Looks like you got quite a few of them. Eight grouper. I don't know how many snapper we had. How far out were you? Um, Like 30 something miles. Just shy of 40, I think. Catalytic cool. converter on outboards. That's stupid. That's where it's going. So they've determined that outboard motors are now polluting so much that they need to. You can't even own, you can't even drive through California with a two stroke. I mean, it's California, but. Right. Come on. Yeah, it's a hundred percent gonna go like electric and whatever. So we can try to dispose of battery. Yeah, the battery thing's gonna be a problem. Yeah. Well, I mean, they recycle them, but there was one battery plant. I forgot exactly where it was. It wasn't in the U.S. That was recycling yeah, them, you can and it the caught on fire. <laughs> Is it your fire exploding? Yeah. The whole plant's not on fire. Oh, that's right. I think it was in Europe somewhere. I don't know if it completely destroyed it or. Well, that's what happened to um, motocross. They have Moto E. Oh, uh, for the electric stuff? I saw that, yeah. The electric bike shot fire. I'm going to go feed the piranha. Everything. Yes. Here they are. <laughs> Nothing will go to waste. They're pretty big too. Circle life. Yep. Oh, that piece was too big for him. Gone. Yeah, a lot of work. It's got a good bit of eight grouper snappers and a bunch of chickens. <laughs> grouper cheeks, grouper throats.
the smoke our cream cheese too, give it a little bit more flavor. Only we keep that on for probably 15 minutes or so. Okay, so here's the lineup for our smoked fish dip. Jalapeno, pepper, some yellow peppers, red peppers, we like the sweet little ones. Green pepper, a little bit of pickled jalapenos and some pepperoncini sliced up. Of course, your spring onions. Saw this in the store today, figured we'd throw that in there. Also, we use almost a whole red onion only Duke's mayonnaise, a little cream horseradish sauce, and then our sour cream, we'll mix it all up together.